When you unbox your machine, it should start at a straight stitch. You might notice that each position on the dial has three different options per position. Let's go to the multi-step zigzag and talk about this. The multi-step zigzag is here in white. In blue is the honeycomb stitch, and in green is the feather stitch. The honeycomb stitch is useful for elastic. The feather stitch is useful for decorative stitching. To get to these, turn your length dial to the color that's coordinated with each stitch. We're going to use the multi-step zigzag stitch. Let's stitch the multi-step zigzag. My stitch length is set to 2, and I'm changing my stitch width all the way to 6 for a wide stitch. Place your fabric and bring down the presser foot. Begin sewing by pressing down your foot on the pedal. Make sure your needle is in the highest position. If it's not, turn the hand wheel towards you. Bring up the presser foot. And there you have a multi-step zigzag stitch. Now let's try the honeycomb stitch. Turn the length dial to the blue number, and we're going to leave our stitch width at six. Place your fabric, bring down the presser foot, and begin sewing. Make sure your needle is up, bring up the presser foot, and there we have a honeycomb stitch. To use the feather stitch, turn the length dial to the green number. I'll be leaving the width the same. Place your fabric, bring the presser foot down, and begin sewing. Make sure your needle is up and bring up the presser foot. And that's a feather stitch. Let's see what happens when we change the stitch length and width. Right now the length is set at 2 and the width at 6. Let's change them both to 4. Place the fabric, bring the presser foot down, and begin sewing. Make sure that the needle is up. If it's not, turn the hand wheel towards you. Bring the presser foot up. And this is the same stitch, set at a length of four and a width of four. Now let's turn the length to one and the width to one. Place your fabric and bring the presser foot down. Now begin sewing. Make sure the needle is up and bring the presser foot up. You can change the length and width of your stitches as you need for all of your different projects.